A group of students at the Academic City University College has reached the advanced stage in the manufacturing of locally made ventilators to aid in the fight against COVID-19. The milestone achieved by the group is to provide ventilators manufactured with less expensive local materials to health facilities. Dr. Lucy Japong, Associate Dean of Engineering, who is speaking at a medical technology fair dubbed Building Local Capacity in Medical Technology, said that this will assist in the treatment of other respiratory diseases. And we have more in this report. Ventilators in the advent of the COVID-19 pandemic became one of the scarce medical supplies due to the high demand at the hospitals in the wake of rising number of recorded cases. Hospital facilities in the country did not have enough ventilators in treating patients suffering from severe cases of COVID. In view of this challenge, a group of students at the Academic City University College has reached the advanced stage in the design and construction of a low-cost ventilator to assist in the treatment of COVID-19 and other respiratory infections. There was a worldwide call for rapid ventilators. People were coming up with solutions because everybody wanted to help. And even though in Ghana, yes, we do have ventilators, you see that all our ventilators in Ghana are all import, um, imported. There are no ventilators that was actually done in Ghana, for Ghana, by Ghana. So we decided at that time that we were going to come up with a ventilator. At that time, borders were closed. So no, nobody could go anywhere. So we had to come up with our own version of a ventilator to help assist in any way that we could. Lucy Japan campaigned for the use of homemade devices to build local capacity. If you look all over the world, um, there are Ghanaians who are excelling But somehow when we come to our home, it looks like we're not doing as much as we can. It is not because of lack of technical know-how, because we have the knowledge, we know how to do it. It's just the backing and the support. So I'm excited about this particular ventilator, and I'm excited that now in Ghana, people are starting to appreciate more made in Ghana goods, all the way from fashion and we line now to push in medical devices as well, because there's a tendency that people don't trust um, a brand if it's made in Ghana. But we're here to show that if we've gone thoroughly through this, um, you know, the rigorous process of testing, validation, you should be able to trust made in Ghana goods. President of the Academic City University College, Professor Fred McBagonluri, says the university is willing to start the manufacturing of other devices to boost healthcare delivery. There are so many problems out there that I'm interested in. I'm interested in why babies die all of a sudden. You know, uh, when I was a kid, I saw many, many of such events where babies car being carried at the back of their parents will all of a sudden get seizures and die. Uh, can you come up with a device that they can put in the cloth so that when the kid's body temperature changes or something, they'll be able to capture that? I think there's a need for that. Uh, we need to make needles and syringes here. I mean, we import all these into the country. With this invention, more of low-cost devices will be available in the country. A report by Prince Osuansa read to you.